Hey guys, welcome back to Living Gratefully or welcome if you're new here. Thank you for clicking on this video. I am so excited about my new beautiful Nespresso machine and I can't wait to share the unboxing with you and my thoughts and my first caramel iced latte. So let's go ahead and get started. My new Nespresso machine is a Nespresso Cities, and I picked it out online at Nespresso.com as well as some of the Nespresso capsules to go along with it. And here we go. I'm going to unpack it all here. I have a little box opener that I love and it's safe with no blades and I'll link that below in the description box for you. I did a lot of research to find the perfect machine for me. There are so many options to choose from. I wanted one that is more of an espresso machine, an actual espresso machine, than a coffee machine. I'm showing a clip of the website and how you can look at all of the original machines and compare them to the Virtuo machines and see which one is best for you. The one I picked is under the original section and it's the Cities and you can see here it comes in other colors and I picked white. The Cities machine comes with a variety package of 14 capsules to get you started. I also ordered some of the sleeves in specific blends like the Caramel Cream Brulee and the Vanilla Eclair. Each sleeve comes with 10 capsules and there are so many different flavors to choose from. On the website you can find descriptions of each coffee, whether it's an espresso, a double espresso, or a coffee type pod, and that acidity level and whether it's decaf or regular. This video is not sponsored. I just wanted to share with you my experience and research and you can also get a milk frother or I think they call it an arachino, but I didn't want that. I've had one of those before attached to my Keurig machine and I didn't use it so I didn't get that. If you order capsules from Nespresso.com or the Nespresso app, you get free shipping and free capsule recycling by sending them back easily through UPS. The aluminum is recycled into everyday objects and the coffee grounds are recycled into compost. There are also Nespresso boutiques that you can either purchase from or drop off your recycling, but I don't have one of those near me. You can also call a 1-800 number like the old fashioned way. The one that I picked is in the original category. The original machines use a small, skinnier capsule. The wider flat pods are the Vachuro pods for the Vachuro machines. So let's get this thing set up.
For the initial setup, we'll want to rinse and fill the water tank, place a container under there, turn on the machine by hitting one of the cup buttons. The buttons will flash while the machine is heating up and this takes about 25 to 30 seconds. Run water through the machine three times to rinse it by hitting the large or the lungo button. That's the bigger cup size or the double espresso size. I like how this is a metal appliance, heavy duty. It's not plastic like the Keurig machine. It's compact, so if you need to save space, this is a great option if you are an espresso lover. Now let's make my first iced caramel latte. The machine puts the old capsules into a storage container inside there for you. They automatically drop in there when you open the lever for the next time you use it. And you can fit nine in there before you need to unload it. That's good. I like it too. I already drank half of it. <laughs> <laughs> A 
It's good. You might like it hot too. Maybe. I think I like it like that. Do you? Yep. Okay. Okay, so you just saw Scott's reaction. He likes it. I love it. Get it back over here near me. It is, I have tried to make something like this with the Keurig and with the Keurig pods, you can, you know, put the espresso, you know, amount of water. It does not taste the same. I've even bought like the Food Lion brand espresso um, Keurig pods and it does not taste the same. This is really good and I'm extremely pleased. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below. If you have used this machine before and you know, want to share your thoughts, leave a comment. If you like videos like this, give me a like and share with your friends and subscribe for more Living Gratefully videos. I'm very grateful for this new machine. I think we're going to have a lot of fun with it. I'll do some more videos with different recipes coming soon.